Lecture 29, Declarative Navigation with Navigator 2.0, Transitioning from Invoice Screen to Payment Screen. So when the underscore invoice status value is set to true, we want to show the payment screen to the user. For that first, open payment screen dart, locate to do, payment screen material page helper and replace it as. Here, we configure a material page, set the payment page's unique key, and create the payment screen widget. Now return to app router.dart, locate to do, add payment screen and replace it as. Here, we're showing the payment screen if the invoice status is set to true, which means that the invoice is successfully created, and then passing the invoice to the payment screen. We're using the if null operator here, which means that if the invoice value is not null, then use the generated value, otherwise set it to an empty string. Save the file. Now let's run our Flutter project for web. First let's create an invoice from the invoice screen. After the invoice is successfully created we see the payment screen appear after the invoice is created. Great, now let's try to pay the invoice. Cool, that's it for this lecture. Thank you.